Yes guys, how are you doing? I'm back with another match day vlog. Two weeks since I've last been in football stadium and I'm chomping to get back into one. And there's only one game for this weekend because it is the Emirates FA Cup second round action. For me, I had to choose the tie of the round and that is Forest Green Rovers versus Alf Church. Why do I think this is the tie of the round? Well, let's put it bluntly. Forest Green Rovers are in the third tier of English football. Alf Church are in the seventh tier of English football. Four tiers separate them, 92 places. Are we gonna see a giant killer today? We will have to wait and see. And listen, I am the biggest fan of the FA Cup and I love to see this competition. And I genuinely think there's something in the air today. Alf Church, from Worcestershire, knocked out Cheltenham Town of League One in that third tier of English football in the first round. It was one of the shocks of the tournament. Could they do the same today? They've already beaten one League One opposition. Could they do it again? I'm here early. I'm out in the Cotswolds. We're going to get in and around the stadium, see what the atmosphere is like. And I've heard that there's going to be a lot of travelling away fans today, and this should be a big one. Come on, let's go. joined by two fans here, Chloe and Evelyn. They're going to give me their score predictions. Chloe, you go first. Uh, I think 2-1 to Rovers. 2-1 to Rovers, love it. And Evelyn? Uh, I think 2-1 Both of you are backing them to win. I love to see it. Good news. <laughs> Here we go then, teams coming out of the tunnel. Flags there, live on BBC One today. 3 p.m. kickoff. Forest Green versus Alf Church. Here we go. Looking forward to this. Here we go then. In the South Stand for the first time this season. And uh, my score prediction for today. I think there's going to be a shock in the cup. Forest Green one. So those are the away fans there, packed out in that away end, crammed in nicely. As I said, they are in the seventh tier of English football, crammed in over there, and let's see if they're going to witness a big giant killing today. As for the rest of the stadium, Forest Green, not as busy as I thought. A lot of empty seats, but this south stand is packed out, ready to rock and roll. Dangerous free kick here. And you can hear this south stand. Trying to get behind the team here. Can they make it count? Yeah. Whoa, big penalty shot there. Forest Green, bit of a tangle up in the box on Josh March. The referee's given it, and there we go, big moment in this game. It's needed it. Connor Wickham, he missed one midweek against Cheltenham, and the Papa John steps up, and there it is. Time and um, wow, that was a terrible first half. I'll get my thoughts in a minute, but really not much happening in that first half in the second round of the FA Cup game. Hopefully, the second half will treat us to a lot better one. Right, second half is about to kick off. As I said, that was one of the worst first halves I've watched in a while this season. Not much happened, not much magic in this FA Cup tie. The goal from the penalty. The crowd has been a bit flat as well. Let's hope it uh, livens up. Big second half coming up. Can Al Church pull off a big comeback? 
I'll come for a screen, hold on, and get through to the FA Cup third round. Oh my. Harry Maguire rescue. Oh my days. Alva Church flying out the blocks here, and that was a half chance there for them. Forest Green need to wake up. Much better start in the second half from Alva Church. Forest Green on the black ropes here, and uh, they've got a dangerous free kick here, central of the goal. Could this be the equaliser? We'll have to wait and see. But they have started brightly and clearly, 70% at half time. Oh my days! Look at those away limbs. Look what it means to those Alf Church fans. Jeez, oh. Wow, just like that. I said it. Goal was coming. Central free kit. Keeper can do nothing about it. Unbelievable limbs on that win. But I called it. And they're coming forward here again. Forest Green need to wake up here, they're not at the paces, and um, what a goal, amazing moment for that team in the 7th tier of church. Here we go, no, this is where the FA Cup no, gets magical. No, no, no. We saw what happened last time in free kit. Is it going to go in again? Hope not. But listen, Forest Green have really dropped off. It's not good enough. There we go. Hey. Hey. Ironic cheers for a poor free kick. And the crowd have just erupted because Bernard has just been sent off for two yellow cards. You can see there the refs pointing him away. You're going to see it now, he's telling him. And uh, that's why Alf Church have just uh, erupted. And there he is, the man who's been sent off. Don Bernard with, uh, what, 18 minutes to go? Not good. And this is funny, and um, from that, Ian Birchall, the uh, Forest Green manager, has told Luke McGee to pretend to be injured. And uh, literally watched it. Literally watched him have to go down. So he's uh, pretending, pretending to be injured here. Bit of time wasting. And you can see the teams now change the plan, change the shape. I love that. Here we go then. This gets interesting. Forest Green, you've got a play of 10 men now with uh, 18 minutes plus stoppage. They've, uh, you know, wasting chances on the final third and not looking the best. So it does make it interesting. And it has livened up the Alpha Church fans as well. So are we going to see a big comeback from Alpha Church? 2 1 down, 18 minutes. And you can hear it's all kicking off. As we come into added time, stop his time about to be announced. South stand here, just getting behind the boys as Forest Green have a free kick just in front of the 18 yard box. And uh, we will see how much stoppage is left in this FA Cup tie. And will they be in the third round? Five minutes added on time. Five minutes. Five minutes away from being in the hat for the third round. Or are we going to see an equaliser and this game goes to a replay? They're asking for the whistle. They're asking for the whistle. Those Alpha Church fans, they believe one more chance. It's got to be this. 
And the wonderful story of Alf Church ends today. And you can see the away fans there just clapping off their players. And the players appreciate those travelling fans today. One and a half thousand of them crammed into that away end. Fantastic, fantastic from the seventh tier team. And there is the winning goal scorer, ex Alf Church player. And the fans appreciate it. Right guys, just walking back to the car now and uh, as I said, it wasn't the magical FA Cup tie I had in my head I was expecting, but at the same time it is a win for Forest Green. They are through to the third round of the FA Cup for only the second time in their history. Poor Alvchurch couldn't quite make that giant kill happen, but you've got to respect, appreciate what they did, the fact they scored and a little bit of drama there. If you have enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Ta-da!